All right, we are officially moving out today. What? We have to be out today and clean the house today. And this is what it looks like, a mess, a hot mess. And some clothes and trash bags. Oh, there's still so much. We're doing last laundry that we can. This is almost empty. This is the my work clothes for the next week or so, since we're gonna be pretty much homeless. This room is a hot mess. <laughs> and yeah, that's where we're at. We slept on the floor last night and then bathroom. book that I don't want to throw away it's been with me for so long this is the only textbook that I didn't throw away after college because this thing was like my best friend that was when you were a puppy and you would chew everything in sight uh, all right I'll throw it away and then my diplomas from Florida State. <laughs> um, we have a degree in geography. I didn't even know that until I opened up my diploma like years later because I'm a failure. And then when I went back to school and got my engineering biomedical, where does it even say it here? Oh, there. Biomedical engineering. So yeah, I want to hang this one up because I think it's hilarious. Bachelor, at least it's a bachelor BS and not a BA. <laughs> um, yeah, that's funny. For my 21st, they gave me this puke bucket, disgusting. I never puked in it, obviously. I would not keep it if I did. This has old photos. Oh, when me and Amy went to California for like two weeks. What else? My mom's, when was this? I think, was this my mom's wedding? This is at my aunt's house. I don't know what holiday. Me, Amy, and Erica. Oh, I was so skinny. What the heck? I threw a party at this house. <laughs> that was that day. I was so skinny. Me and Sammy. 
This is when I did a mission trip to Panama for when I wanted to do dental school on a boat for Cinco de Mayo when I went to UCF I found my friend Kelly oh my god <laughs> this is crib before Amy and Christian were dating <laughs> and that was his best friend Brandon oh my god I love these pictures like a this is my old co-workers when I used to work at a restaurant in Tallahassee. Oh, do you remember Reptar? Reptar? When I, my roommates in college. He has a name, don't call him Reptar. Aldrian. <laughs> this is when me and my cousin went to South Carolina, University of South Carolina, to for parents weekend. <laughs> I know. This is when Victoria's Secret bathing suits were like the thing to wear. Oh my god, look at how tan I was. Stop. Look at my, me then and look at me now. I'm a different human being. <laughs> I don't get tan like that anymore. That's me right there. Oh my god, I wish I still got that tan. This is when I was going to the Keys like every, every other week. That summer. Oh my god, I was there all the time. I was so skinny. What is going on? This is when I first moved to Tallahassee. And I was going out. Look, this is when I first moved to Tallahassee and was living with my cousin. That's, this was the most fun bar in Tall at FSU. It was called AJ's. And on Tuesdays, it was called Flippin' Tuesdays. So you would flip a coin and if you get if you got what you guessed, you would get a 25 cent drink. Leave it. Okay, I need to stop going through these pictures and pack. This is when we went lobstering in the Keys. Look how much lobster we got. Good times. Okay, let's keep going, David. Come on, it's like getting late. All right, update. Closet is completely done. The bedroom, we just have the mattress. This that bathroom's done. We just need to do a quick, quick clean laundry, the last load. Towels. This room, this room, all done. There's Lily. And then we just have the downstairs, which is done, but that's where everything is. Look who's taking a break. Mr. Takes Breaks. Okay, come on. Oh, we need to also do like a quick clean. Eat. No, I want the upstairs completely finished before we eat. We're taking a break. I thought we were gonna be done by one, and it's two and we're not done. We're gonna go get Popeyes. And we're walking to our car because the moving truck is in our driveway, so we can't park there. But, yeah. All right, last part to moving out is bringing all of this into the truck. I'm so tired. I think I've run up and down the stairs at least 100 times today. <laughs> Lily is in the way every time. Okay, let's see right here. of this vlog it's over a week so we moved out that last footage you saw i believe was sunday last sunday and it's the next what's today friday so it's been about two weeks almost um we moved in this week on 
Tuesday, Tuesday was like the first day we moved everything in. Uh, well, mostly everything, like probably 90% of things. But we didn't stay here that night. Everything was just a mess. The bed was just flipped over. We were so tired. So we were like, let's not. And then we came back the following night and we assembled the bed. And that was pretty much it. Um, and I like kind of started the bath. I did the bathroom and the bed. So that I have like, you know, my face wash, makeup ready for the next day for work. And then, yeah, so that was yesterday was our first morning in the apartment and then today. So it's still a huge freaking mess, like huge mess. And I still need to get quite a few things, but we could do like a before and then I can do like an updated um tour or whatever because i'm gonna i'm gonna make it cute i have some ideas it's very tiny though like we're going from a three bedroom two and a half bath townhome to a one one the lighting is pretty horrible um to a one one with not one storage closet besides the closets in our bedroom so it's really really tight but i have some ideas on how to make it work i have bar stools coming in i have a rug coming in for here i threw away the old rug uh trying to sell my old bar stools but no one has bought it yet bought it yet oh i sounded like andrew tate bought it yet <laughs> okay um and then here this used to be so cute like little bookshelves and now we have all of our books which i kind of like it it gives like the living room some character i think with all of the like not perfect you know look so but that's not gonna stay there i'm either gonna buy a new one of this that has like some you know closed doors or i'm gonna buy like this armoire how do you say that i'm gonna buy this armoire type thing i don't know i have a couple ideas i have to see um but yeah so let's show you uh we moved i think i said to the coral gables area and then this is some of miami here that you can see and so yeah we are walking distance to a bunch of restaurants and bars and hold on i'm getting a work call hold that thought <laughs> okay so we're back <laughs> um I went downstairs because I got my spices. Like I got the containers to put the spices. I like these because um, they ha they come with this. They had like other ones that were really cute with a wooden top as well, but it just had like all open. And I get that's good for like some spices where you're gonna use like a spoon when you're using a lot. But sometimes I just need a little sprinkle, sprinkle. Um. And yeah, so this, I did the first one, cinnamon, cinnamon, look how cute. It, and it comes with all the labels to everything. Um, it comes with like a funnel and they have different types. Oh, I almost think these are really cute too. They're just like, it's not yellow. It's like you, it's just the name. They're like white and it, that's really cute actually. Hmm. Damn, that's a toughie. Well, I already started with the other ones. So, and then they also have, I think they had another option. Yeah, they have like this option, which is probably my, I don't really like that. So, but that's nice that it comes with three options. Damn, I kind of like, like the simple white. Hmm. Oh, well. Yeah. Oh well. So that's what I'm doing now. Um, and where I left off showing you the place. It's a mess, sir. Oh, so I barely have any storage. And the reason why I got these was because um, I got like these magnetic things for the side of the fridge, like little shelves. And I'm going to put all the spices there because I don't really have space. I don't have a pantry. So I need one of these cabinets to work as a pantry and the less space of the less things I can put in there, the better. So, um, yeah. 
Uh, so let's do it from the front, I guess. You walk in here, and I wanna put like a big something here with like shelves and doors and drawers to cover that up. And I have this here, but it's not gonna stay there. I was gonna put a little table here. I was probably gonna use this bench and put it along that wall to act as extra seating and then three chairs maybe. And then the living room, again, I already mentioned, but I have a rug coming in for this. The chairs are honestly a bit too big. So I might either just keep one, sell both, keep both, I'm not sure yet. I also have two uh, bar stools coming in. And then the kitchen, we're gonna change out all the hardware to be black because the countertop has like black in it and I think it will just make it look a little more modern um, things are just all over the place it's trash bathroom I'm gonna change all of this hardware as well to be black um, shower I got shelves for in here because that's not enough space for all the stuff we need and I also want to put some shelves up here or something like that. And then the washer and dryer, the tiniest washer I've ever seen in my life. That's just hand towels, look how tiny. <laughs> um, and then just some cleaning stuff. That's the AC unit and then the bedroom. So thank God our king bed fit in here. And here's the window to the outside and there's at least two closets and they connect in the middle closet space isn't too terrible could be worse but also could be better <laughs> i might get like one of those ikea things because this is very thin right here though i think they're called like the alex drawers or something i don't know something very small and tall with a bunch of drawers for like underwear socks bras um Maybe workout clothes, pajamas. I also wanted to get new nightstands with maybe two drawers. I don't need that, but I probably won't. But I don't really like these nightstands. They, and I could do like taller ones, but it's fine. That's like last on the list. These are canvases that I'm gonna put up on top of the bed. I made these with plaster. They're not very cute, but <laughs> they take up a lot of space, which is nice. And that's literally it. It's the tiniest little apartment, but it's kind of cute and it's getting cuter as I like put things together. I put some cookbooks there, wine glasses, cutting board to cover. There was, a, there was an ethernet, um, is that what it's called? An ethernet port there, covering that up. This is the little coffee station. I need to get dish soap holder. We have Lily's, oh, Lily's treats up here. I'm gonna organize that better, probably. I don't know, we'll take this down. Whatever, for now that's staying up there. <laughs> and yeah, so we got a lot, a lot, a lot to do. Oh, the internet's not working, so I have a guy coming out here any, any minute now to help set it up because they said that they they couldn't find, I don't know, they couldn't find a connection, something or other. And anyways, but we have a corner unit, so we have two windows, which is nice. The Like, I look dark right now because if I'm here, you know, the sun is behind me, but the lighting in the apartment overall is very, pretty good. So I'm gonna do these spices and then get back to work for the rest of the day. And that's it. I guess I'll end the vlog here.